We were all pretty stunned. Uh, we were in the courtroom waiting for opening statements to begin, and then suddenly the judge asked Kellen Winslow the second, uh, are you changing your plea? Plea that is to guilty, and he said yes, but he really seemed to struggle with this decision. Is that been enough time for you to make a, an informed decision about your decision today? Because the, the option is to go to trial. We have jurors out there waiting to start with opening statements. Kellen Winslow II struggles with his decision to take a plea deal moments before his second trial on rape charges was about to begin. Have any other promises been made to you to get you to plead guilty today? Um, um, is, there, is there any way I could get a couple minutes or no? The former NFL football player eventually agrees to plead guilty to having sex with Jane Doe number 4, a 17-year-old back in 2003 who was unconscious at the time. He also pled guilty to sexual battery against Jane Doe number 1, a hitchhiker who says Winslow raped her behind a strip mall. Rather than life in prison, he now faces 12 to 18 years behind bars. You give me 12 and I can go home to my family as soon as possible, Your Honor. Outside the courtroom, his defense attorneys told us this. Ladies and gentlemen, state prison is, in California, it's state prison. It's, it's, it's like they show in movies and TV. I mean, so it's not a nice place to be. So you have to make a, a decision, and it weighed heavily on him. But the downside of any conviction uh, would land him in prison for the rest of his life. And he made a decision based upon his family, uh, his father, uh, his children. Back in June, Winslow was convicted of sex crimes involving three other women, but the jury deadlocked on the remaining counts. Deputy District Attorney Dan Owens says he, too, was surprised a plea deal was reached today. I was told this morning that they had worked hard over the weekend to discuss with Mr. Winslow uh, the parameters of a potential change of plea, and it was not until this morning that they offered the specific resolution that uh, ultimately we agreed to. So as part of that plea agreement, uh, the remaining charges, including forcible rape, were dropped against uh, Winslow II. Now, his defense attorneys hinted at what they'll be bringing up, uh, possibly at his sentencing hearing, which includes uh, his medical history. They say he suffered traumatic brain injury during his time on the football field, as well as a motorcycle accident. Uh, his sentencing hearing is set for February 19th.